Hello everyone, it's me here, Kevin Patan, and welcome to Survival Aquatic Season 2. So, yes, this is a whole new brand season, and um, I've already started out with all this stuff. I mean, really, you guys haven't mi missed out much other than me possibly dying nine times in line as the stream, but, I mean, really, you haven't missed out that much. So, um, basically, to summarize, what happened was I found this area far, far away from a uh, base, and uh, I get, I've been starting working on this castle. Um, I've gotten this little chicken farm for uh, food because I basically have no other sources. Um, whoever it was, I think it was, yeah, Impulse, I think, came over here and he built this nether portal. So that was very nice of him, and all I've been doing was really just gathering some blocks for this. And, uh, for today's episode, we're just gonna basically finish this little castle up, so we actually have a base to, uh, go to and from, and that looks kind of pleasing. This is the change that I'm doing from last season. Last season, more, my base is more of a functional type thing, I didn't care so much about the aesthetic look. Um, this season, I'm going to be, yeah, as you all can see, this is gonna be the start of our castle, it's gonna be... Hopefully a lot more aesthetically pleasing. Uh, obviously it's looking a little better from last season. Oops, that's not where I want to go. But yeah, so we're just going to get started with this. Uh, hopefully we'll have a time lapse going around of us building. So, yeah, I'll see y'all when this build is finally done.
So, um, that was pretty fun. We actually got this whole castle done. Um, this thing took, like, eight hours. Took me, like, two weeks in total, but I wasn't, like, playing the whole two weeks. <laughs> um, but yeah, this thing took, like, forever to build, but we finally got it done. And, yeah, we got everything here. We got our, like, towers. So, here's tower one. We got this little jail cell. If we want to put any villagers in here or whatever, um, we got this narrow tower staircase, of course. And the best thing about this is the view. I mean, since we built this on the, since we built this on a mountain, if we go to the front, we literally get the whole river. We get down here, and yeah, if we go down here too, we also get a little bit. And the nice part about it is, to behind us, we get a hill that kind of gives us a little bit of protection as well. So, this thing just went, well, very well. I, I couldn't have picked a better spot, I think. So, this was great. And, yeah, um, I'm just going to go head out, and I'll meet you guys if anything interesting happens. So, I uh, recorded a part with Random where we uh, were battling this Elder Raid that was basically unstoppable because they just kept on summoning in. Only issue is when I did do that was I didn't record my audio. So, that's going to be scrapped, but, as always, I have another plan that we can do. So, as y'all may know, Random uh, pranked me in my little tiny dirt hut. Was it dirt? No, I think it was wood. Well, Random pranked me in my wood hut with uh, some cobwebs. And, as a tradition of Scribal Aquatic, uh, we like to, um, prank each other with chickens as well, so I think I'm going to be the first little guest to go ahead and do that. So, that's us going to get payback on him for what he did at the start, because, I mean, what, he thinks he'd get away with that? No, of course not. So, I'm just going to fill up my, uh... Inventory of all of these eggs, I'll meet you guys over at his base. Alright, so we're at his portal to his base. We're just gonna walk in and hopefully we'll spawn in his base and not somewhere else. So we're here in random space. So this is his old chicken farm. <laughs> he has plenty of eggs, although I'm not gonna steal there. I'm not gonna steal his and use that to contribute to my own prank. I am gonna be using the eggs from my own personal chicken farm. And I think we're going to use some on the top of his roof, and I think we're going to do some inside each of his layers. So, let's go ahead and do that. I think the best approach here is... Yeah, alright, so we're just going to use like a whole row, of just for, you know, whatever. So we're just going just gonna to plop some of these chickens around, and yeah, that'll, that'll be it, basically. I mean, that'll be the main part. So, I'll see you guys right back. So, as you all may know, this is merely not enough punishment for him yet. So, just... Oops, not that. <laughs> so, just to punish him a little bit more, we are going to be uh, hiding some of these chickens. Just so... Alright, not right there, but we're going to be hiding some of these chickens so he can't find them, and they'll just make loud noise that annoys him to death. So, subscribe put one right here. Seems like a little gate. He has uh, his own weird experiments going on, I guess. So, I think that'll be it. I think, yeah, I'm not gonna take any from him because, I mean, it's his eggs. I'm not gonna support that to the own ranking. If we go up here... Oh, wait, is there another... Oh, he has a roof. I've never been up here. That's actually a pretty nice looking enchantment. Whoa! Alright, I guess he's rocking all those, uh, the new furnace types, that's for sure. This is, this isn't actually a bad, uh, house, actually. It supports a lot of the stuff, although I would recommend, like, getting rid of these chests and putting them into chest storage. He did pretty well. So, yeah, uh, hello. So, we're just gonna go back to our base, and, uh, we'll probably settle there, or settle from there, and, yeah, so, I'll see you guys over there. So, um, I really need to get this video out, so I'm just going to end the episode right here today. And, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!